over here to do the relaunch of the uh, first Save the Lango campaign. This year we will not have a deadline. We will continue this project until further notice. We will keep on going and going, selling as much as possible. This sort of relationship is very, very important. Oftentimes people look at the environment and conservation and think of it as being something kind of separate and away and off to the side. But when it comes down to it, the work you're doing here relies very much on the environment. And working together with conservation and business and with the politics all together. We decided to relaunch the Save the Cat for Lango campaign mostly due to its success back in uh, 2017. Back then we did a three-month campaign, which um, basically was uh, much more successful than we anticipated. The onboard passengers really um, enjoyed hearing about the stories of the Capra Lango and about this uh, endangered species. So for us it wasn't really a question about um, if we would relaunch it, rather than when we would relaunch it. So now we will start the campaign once again and we will keep it running without uh, or until further notice. Probably the most obvious example of this is a young girl, a half Vietnamese girl, who came to visit this area with her family last year. And she came on the cruises with her family, got one of the toys, heard about the langur and the larger situation here, got very interested and very excited. And when she went back home, she organized by herself a fundraiser for us and raised a little over a thousand dollars, which for a 10 year old is really good. For an adult, it's very good. For a 10 year old, it's especially good. The projects like this are really, really important because awareness is kind of the first step along the way to making a change. And what's happening here with the large volume of guests that Biocruises gets allows that awareness to be spread very widely, not just in this local area, but internationally. And that helps all of us both here in the island and also in the larger conservation picture because people will take this idea, take this awareness home and they will use this new knowledge and new understanding they have to help fix things in their own home also. So yes, I think this project has been very, very good and very successful in raising awareness. In two, before 2007, it's not many people they know about this cat kind of monkey, about the uh, cat Balagor, but after the campaign, so now the many people they know about this cat kind of monkey. So when a family cruising with us and uh, we tell them about uh, Save the Langer campaign, they feel, you know, this campaign is very meaningful because we'll educate uh, the, their children about the safe environment and safe endangered animals.